Mitch has been taken over the league by storm. He's hitting the ball as good as anybody who doesn't have the last name Cole, but his impact on the game is way more important than anybody might realize. He comes out in the first quarter and bang, pins him at the seven yard line. Now you're thinking this may be good, but let's take a step back to look at the bigger picture. Seahawks get stopped and have to punt it back and now look at where the Niners are starting from. It's an absolute game changer because it turns this 16 yard run to be so much different as he's going from the 45 to the 28 than it would be like, let's say if he was going from the opposite 30 to the 42. He just moved them into easy field goal range off of one single play. And then his next punt, he comes back out, does the banana ball, and pins the Hawks at their own one yard line. And then, you know, one thing leads to another. Now the Niners are starting barely on the other side of the 50, which they have a whole playbook to use from this spot. Unlike the Seahawks, who are constantly being backed up. So naturally, as the Niners only have to drive a total of 90 yards to get two touchdowns, this is a recipe for success when you're making your opponents drive twice that length just to match you. This, of course, is made so much more brutal when Mitch throws up a tomahawk of a punt, it comes down, and isn't securely caught, then is for whatever reason not dove upon by the returner, and instead allows the Niners to pounce on it and get the ball back with a little time left in the half to extend their lead. Finally, as the game is going to close out, and he's going to hit a 51-yarder to start the Hawks at their 20, where it took them 13 plays to only walk away with a field goal and then he busts out the pitching wedge gets the ball onto the green at the 13 yard line but why most people don't recognize what he's doing here is because they can't see what i like to call the old one two punch it's where the offense gets the ball to maybe around midfield the punter does a great job pinning the opposing team deep in their territory the defense then gets a stop as they punt it back starting your offense in great field position which allows you to turn that into points and this game every single time that mitch punted the ball and the Seahawks were forced to punt the ball back, it resulted in a touchdown, meaning he had three of those one-two punches, as well as just causing a turnover himself to put points up on the board. And nobody is really talking about how important and how impactful to the Niners game plan that is. Mitch is an absolute weapon right now. Added an element. Watch the way this thing is spinning sideways. 16 punts now down inside the 20-yard line.